guys. Hey guys, I got one more video. Well, maybe it'll be my last one, unless I end up staying in Florida a little longer. It's supposed to be my last day, but things are really taking lots of twists and turns. So, as you might know, I live in North Carolina and I am a server in a restaurant. So this morning we found out that they were closing all restaurants, which I suspected anyway, so I was kind of prepared, but it was an interesting day to find out because I was heading back tomorrow. So I was kind of struggling with even taking the time off to come to Florida to see my daughter um, off for her trip to Uganda, which by the way is postponed for a month. So I got down here. Uh, but before I came, there was another struggle. I had to leave a little bit earlier because unfortunately and very sadly, my brother died of an overdose. So if you didn't hear my old videos, that's another story. So I had to drive from North Carolina to Connecticut, uh, have a service for my brother, go through all that emotional mess with my family because it was unexpected and obviously horrible. And I have other people in the family that are addicts, so oh, it was just really rough. But anyways, got through that, came down here, had a great time with my kids. Um, I've been really drawn to a church down here that I used to go to years ago. It's actually the pastor who married my husband and I, Grace and Faith Church in Tampa. And I've been going there and it's amazing. Definitely on the verge of revival there. So that was great too. Um, so anyway, get ready to leave and all this happens this morning. So right now I'm walking down a path at John Chestnut Park in Palm Harbor, Florida. I am killing some time before I go to a prayer meeting tonight. And then after the prayer meeting is um, a movie with my children. I still believe with Jeremy Camp story. So I'm really looking forward to that. So after that, um, 